Okay, my camera cut me off again. Does that mean that it died? Or that it's going to die? Or I'm just talking too much? This is crazy. 22 comments and way too long. Okay, so almost done, I swear. So student loans, I'm a sophomore right now. I'm at like 40 credits or whatever it is. And I'll be able to do fast track. I'll have enough credits and I'll be through school enough at a point where I can do fast track all year round, all semesters. And I haven't had to take out a dollar, a penny in student loans yet. And I don't have a job right now. I've had four jobs in my like history of jobs. And that has allowed me to save a lot and not have to take out student loans, which has been real nice. And it's just been great. It's been a really good thing. And I'm obviously going to have to, like every student has to. Um, so I'm pretty proud of myself for that, though. So shop less. I really need to work on that. Um, I went through a phase. I was a shopaholic. I was always online, just Forever 21, Down East, just all of these cute sites, my favorite clothing whatever and it was just consuming my time and it ruled my life and it ruined my life for a while just that just bad thing it's, it's not a good thing so like I have a lot of stuff I do you see my room right but just having to work on that um anyway so get ready for the day put your face on that's what I call it got the makeup on um, you will have a more successful and productive day, and when I was an online student, I liked to do that too. Sometimes I would be in my pajamas, but at least I showered, and made my hair cute, and put my face on, stuff like that. Um, I would also, I would show up in school, I would show up to school, show up to school, in sweats or pajamas, and it wasn't as good of a day. So this was back in middle school, I think it was like in 8th grade, I was wearing pajama bottoms, my cute pink and black plaid ones, and I just didn't have as good, good of a day, and I thought that was interesting. So I don't know if I was being judged by other people, or I thought I was being judged, so I didn't have a good day then, or that way, or maybe it was just like, hey, I'm just not feeling confident in my own skin, so I, I'm not going to have a good day because of that, that mindset. So if you're home all day, your job is just like a job in the home, um, you can still look cute and you will feel good about yourself. You will feel like you took time for yourself before your day began. And that's really great. Now this really should have been first, but anyway, we just had Thanksgiving actually. So be grateful and show it. You can show it through Thanksgiving. Just live in Thanksgiving daily. You've probably all heard that. Always be excited about something. Just that alone will show that you're grateful for your life and be grateful that you are alive. So, yes. Um, one second. Oh. Is it going? It's going. You're going. And you're probably also going crazy. All right. So, this was part three, and that bothers me. I'm sorry. I don't really do part threes, do I? Okay. So, yeah, just be grateful. I'm really grateful for this guy. I don't know if you can see me. Can you see us? Okay. Oh, he stretched. He stretched his little long body. Okay. I'm not grateful for homework right now. And that's what I have to do next. But yeah. So, I'm going to say goodbye, turn off the camera, plug it in the camera, we'll like charge it, and I have to do that because I've been talking too much and my camera's probably going to die again, and I should really let you go, and this is part three, <laughs> plus I have homework to do, and yeah, so anyway, um, just that last thought, just being grateful, being thankful, just having a grateful heart, um, that's always how I end my prayers. I end my prayer with that word. Well, not like, in the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Grateful. No. Um, I just say, I say these things with a grateful heart in the name of Jesus Christ, amen. So that's how I like to end my prayers. And I am grateful that I'm 22. 
I've survived 22 years of life on this earth, and that's pretty crazy to me. I mean, that's, that's kind of a long time. And I have way less than 100 years, way less left <laughs> compared to the day that I was born. Um, but just 22. I'm really going to be kinder to myself this year. Well, this age being 22. Um, now I'm getting comfortable again. That means I'm going to talk more. Okay, so now I have to get uncomfortable. Alright, thank you for watching and... Okay, yeah, goodbye. <laughs>